Hi friends, I'm Alice. Thank you so much for watching. This is the part two of um, the journey for the time we went to Hong Kong. And it's it's um, from when we visited the Hong Kong Heritage Museum because they had an exhibition on the Louvre and so I was super excited because <laughs> I really love paintings and I especially love um, sculptures. So I was not dis disappointed. Um, I, I don't know, we went there and we were quite in a rush. We had to meet someone later in the evening, so we only had about two hours there. And I wish we could have stayed longer because <laughs> I could stare at paintings and sculptures all day long. I don't know what it is, I get so kind of hypnotized by, by sculptures. Just when I think about that, this, 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 you know, this sculpture is actually stone, a block of stone, and someone put so much passion and so much effort and time into it to carve all these details, and you can, you can almost feel the silk, and you can kind of hear the blood rushing through the veins. It's, I, I feel so much joy and so much peace <laughs> looking at those those art pieces so um I really enjoyed it there they had beautiful paintings and um this the one that I'm doing that is actually one of my favorite pieces that I saw there and um I wanted to glue down this piece as a whole and just to have um to have all the attention focused onto the painting and not onto anything else I'm sorry my phone um so I decided to glue it down uh, kind of lengthwise and <laughs> to only glue down a piece and then write down who it is from and uh, what the painting is called and to not add any more details that would maybe um, kind of distract from the painting itself. Uh, so yeah, other than that the, um, the museum had, of course it had other exhibition as well. Um, it had one on Bruce Lee and then also on the uh, China dynasties um, on, f on I think eight, eight emperors. Yeah, eight different emperors and it was all, all so 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 um, cool and just very very interesting. <laughs> I really enjoyed it there. Um, yeah, I uh, what else do I want to tell you? I'm so sorry, I'm so confused. Oh yeah, um, a few days after we actually got back from Hong Kong and we, um, <laughs> I found out that there would be a Hong Kong TN user meetup and I was so sad about that because, um, I don't know, I feel like this passion for Travis Notebook and this this passion for um, paper and pens and letter notebooks is not really shared by a lot of people. Um, at least not the people around me or my friends. Um, so I always I always wanted to join a user meetup group to get to know other people, to see their notebooks, to get get inspiration from their creativity, and to just you know meet friends and with meet friends with the same passion so um yeah I was so sad <laughs> I was so sad about that especially since they would have um a lot of the limited edition stamps and I wanted to stamp my letter notebook as I've said and um they also had a limited edition uh octopus card which is the um metro card in Hong Kong you can actually pay pretty much everything with it. You can just top it up with money and then you can also pink in, in restaurants and stuff like that. So um, yeah, I know. <laughs> I was a little bit disappointed but um, it's okay. I hope I will have a lot more other chances or opportunities to go. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm actually filming or no, I'm recording this voiceover. Um, now that I'm back in Vienna, I did not have the time in China to to record or do anything. The last few days were very stressful, and um, our flight our flight back to to Vienna was super awful. <laughs> I honestly do not recommend Air China. 
Um, at least not if you fly to um, Beijing, which is the capital. So, um, because um, I think Beijing has a lot of bad weather conditions, and then your flight will get delayed, and then it will get cancelled, like mine. <laughs> and we had to lug our our check-in luggage, which is quite huge and quite heavy, and we had to just lug that around to the hotel and then back to the airport. But then they told us no, it's cancelled, so we had to go back to the hotel. And when we finally arrived in Beijing, um, of course we missed our connecting flight, and because uh, because of the strong wind, they um, they told us that there would be no flights going out to Vienna until the day after tomorrow. So they rescheduled us to fly over Poland and then to Vienna, which was so, so, it was just so exhausting. <laughs> it was exhausting because the longer you fly and the longer your layovers, um, the worse your jet lag will be. So <laughs> I'm currently still quite jet lagged. I'm still quite confused and um, it was so exhausting I don't know I really don't like flying I I'm not sure I um I get this really painful pressure in the ear and it's the kind of pain where you just want to cry and just rip your ears off because it hurts so 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 badly <laughs> I guess I'm just not a person to go on planes but it's pretty much the only method to visit my my grandma and my grandpa so um Gotta do that. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm sorry for all the rambling. I, know I haven't done any voiceovers in so long that I feel a little bit awkward and I feel the need to keep on talking so that I don't feel too awkward. <laughs> um, but I do want to thank you guys so, so, so much for me reaching 1,000 subscribers. Um, it's, it's amazing to me. Um, I, I know compared to a lot of other YouTubers, it might not be a lot or something worth mentioning, but to me it's absolutely astonishing because <laughs> I used to be so, so private about my journaling. Um, but I realized that the more I, I hide my journals, the more of a, of, of kind of, of kind of like a very secretive secret person I get and I don't want to do that because when I do that I get very secluded and I keep shutting myself off from other people and um, putting my journals out there is kind of like putting myself out there for others to see and um, since my journals kind of represent a part of me um, and for you all to like that and to enjoy that and to actually support me with all your kind words it's it makes me so happy and I I feel so much joy and it fills me with this warm fuzzy feeling and um, so I really really want to thank you all thank all of you um, I also do read all of your nice comments. I'm sorry if all my replies seem like the same ones. It's always just thank you, thank you. <laughs> but that's honestly what I feel. I have no other words than thank you. I do read all of the comments and I also recognize a lot of the names from people who comment a lot and it just feels so nice to see some of you back in the comment section so <laughs> thank you all so so much for kind words it really makes me happy um ouch my, my shoulder <laughs> sorry <laughs> um i do have a giveaway planned um but i'm i'm still trying to figure out what to give you guys um because i'm not working anymore so i can't give you something too grand and too expensive and i'm really sorry about that um but I'll try to do my best to give you guys something nice and hopefully something that you'll like. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned for that. <laughs> I will announce it on on another video, I guess. Um, and I'm still not sure where to host it. I don't know if I if I'm gonna um, make the entries over Instagram or on here. Uh, but we'll figure this out. I'm I'm still thinking about it. Um. Yeah, I'm, I have a few videos planned and 
I will upload them as soon as I have them filmed and edited. Uh, but I do want to tell you guys that I'm trying to concentrate a bit more on my studies and on my social life. <laughs> and um, so I guess I won't be as active on here. I might still be able to upload one video or so or two in a month. But um, because back back in July and June, I think I uploaded once every week. I'm still not sure. I I need to figure figure all this stuff out. But um, anyways, thank you all so so much for your ongoing support, all the love, and all the kind kind comments. I really appreciate them all. I hope you enjoyed this journal with me. There will be a flip through of this um, journal insert coming up soon. I hope you enjoyed this and um, yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.